All right, we had some questions about how we're going to insulate this panel after we installed it. So we're going to show you how to do that today. Okay, we're out in the shop and we've cut a couple pieces of styrofoam. These are just some pieces that were uh, on some packing material that we received. It's about three quarters of an inch thick. And we cut two pieces, so it would be about an inch and a half thick total. And it's just a little bit thinner than the edges of the piece of ceiling, as you can see here. And we're just going to use some standard Elmer's glue. And uh, spread that around and just glue these down. It's not going to be a real heavy uh, load, so just a little bit of Elmer's glue is going to be more than enough to get this to stick. And uh, it'll provide all the all the adhesion that we need to keep these things in place. So we'll just glue the first one on and uh, then we'll throw the second one right on top of that. So there's enough glue for layer number one. And again I'm just leaving a little bit of an edge on both sides so that it won't uh, it won't have any problems as we put it up in there. And then I'm going to go ahead and throw some glue on the next uh, layer. And I think I'm going to put that one a little closer to the edge just to keep any air from going in between them. This should provide a really nice uh, insulation value. I don't know what the R rating would be, but uh inch and a half of styrofoam is as good as your cooler and uh, should do pretty good. And of course, depending on your application, you could reduce the size here. I would just caution you that if you get too close, you might have trouble fitting it into your attic space again. So let's go get this thing installed after it gets dried out. Okay, we've got our insulated piece and uh, we've got a little glue on there to hold it in place. We're just going to slide that up. And drop it into place. Now, if you wanted to really get some insulation, uh, high insulation value, and you weren't going to be going up there a lot, you could caulk around this edge. Hey, hang on, buddy. You could caulk around the edge, and uh, if you do need to be going in and out, you could also try a little piece of foam weather stripping around there to seal everything. Hope that uh, answers your question, and we'll see you later.